everyone and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World The Game! Where we are back in the UK and I'm using like terrible headphones and like I can't even hear my own voice so this is gonna be terrible. <laughs> There's probably like we'll have a few teething issues to start with but we're here! We're back! I can only apologize for the uh, audio that's here. Trust me, I fix it in the next video, but like I said, it's teething issues. We'll get there eventually. So, uh, what brings us back to Jurassic World the game? Well, uh, not too long ago, there was a ghost tournament. And um, I did the best that I could do in said ghost tournament. However, there was a little bit of an issue. And that was that um, I, uh, I, I had to take a flight that took 13 hours and then I had transfers and all that jazz. So I unfortunately could only do so much of the tournament and eventually- Oh look we've got a battle incubator ready! Uh, <laughs> Jurassic World Alive! Unfortunately I could only do so much and I ended up winning the Predator League, like the one below the ghost. So I didn't unlock ghost. However, I, I <laughs> went up to Ludia and I went Please, I, I tried my best, I could only do so much. And they went, all right, you little scamp, yeah. So, uh, unfortunately, I was an idiot and I, I put in a mono stego whatever and I forgot how long it takes. Uh, but we have one of those. And if we go into hatching, we go into carnivores and we scroll to the legendaries, we should, not there, we've probably already passed it, haven't we? Uh, wait, where is it? Hold up, hold up, hold up. Still hold up. I think what's happened is that I've unlocked it, but they they haven't given me one. <laughs> okay, so, but there it is. We have a ghost and we can do an instant hatch. And there he is. She is. I don't actually know. Oh, here's the sauna. There we go. Look at you. Beautiful ghost. Now, what's interesting about you know the the uh, the Atrociraptor squad, you could say, is that it, the these were dinosaurs that were kind of like it was Colin Trevorrow's way of recapturing Jurassic, the magic of Jurassic World, right? I mean, come on, we we can't say it wasn't. Uh, but I don't think doing it was necessarily a bad thing. I think it was just executed wrong because. In the movie, the Atrociraptors literally serve one purpose, and that's to get Chris and, and Bryce Dallas Howard and whatever uh, to the plane and to get off. But in the games and everything, they, they make it, and merchandise, they make it seem like this was the new Raptor squad. And it, it seems like maybe they were going that way, maybe there was a script where there was more backstory, there was more focus on them. Because I don't think having, you know, the, another Raptor Squad or something is necessarily a bad idea. I think it could have been really cool if it was executed correctly. However, it wasn't. <laughs> but uh, it'll be interesting here to find out more about the Atrociraptor. Uh, whether or not Ludio have just put in generic facts on carnivores or, or something. We'll find out, so let's have a look. So, Ghost is an Atrociraptor. Cool! Uh, though alone, with the re along with the rest of her pack, she was likely bred using modified Velociraptor DNA as well. Well, we, we, we kind of expected that. So now, uh, we need to make loads of Atrociraptors, which kind of goes against... Uh, hold on, I'm, I'm kind of wondering, like, I want to do one regular. Okay, so it's 1,600 bucks, so yes, actually, it's way better to have just done the instant hatches. <laughs> uh, so that's four we've got, we need another four, however... Oh no, there, there's another one, okay, so we need another three, that's gonna cost us like 2,000 each. Oh my god, wow. Um, there has been some uh, changes when it came to... Uh, this game, which are very good, um, whereas now, depending on if it, it might be books, sometimes it's DNA. Uh, hold on, let me just check to see if this is good. No, it's not. Uh, if you go into World we'll Collector like Card Pack, you now, I think, every day may get something new. You might get something interesting to instantly get level 40. So if we go in here, we have two. Okay, so that's a bit. Uh, that's a bit extravagant. 
250,000 bucks for a level 40 Pachygalosaurus. Uh, no. no, I don't. I don't know who was like, you know, what would be good for this one? Uh, uh, Two hundred fifty thousand bucks. Are you freaking serious? Whoever, whoever's idea on the team was to make that two hundred fifty thousand bucks, maybe DNA. But even then, probably not. Uh, you probably need more book, uh, DNA because that's probably a bargain. That's wrong. <laughs> that is wrong on so many levels. Who has 250,000 bucks? Nobody! And even to buy like 250,000 bucks right off the gate is... It's hundreds! You know, what we're talking about, like... 500 pound? When, when books are so hard to come by, you, you put it at a level which is almost impossible to get. Nobody is getting that. Anyway, we're here. <laughs> uh, so I'm just gonna collect that. Do we have any trades? We could get something interesting. Oh yeah, look, 79 books. All we need is 249,900 odd extra books to get that unlocked. So, I mean, it's, it's pretty much it. We're, we're pretty much there at the moment. So I will actually, uh, oh my God, yes. Oh, almost up to 99 million food, which is very good. Um, mm, let's see, nothing really that great. A blimp, I suppose. Trading that for some DNA, it's probably, I'm probably taking a hit on that. Trade that for some DNA, but there isn't really much. Come on, just one good one. One good box. That's all I need. I'll trade that flag for 15 DNA. Why not? Um, oh, that's good. Although, I'll save that till we fed Ghost up max. Um, because... I'll be wasting because I've only I only need one million six hundred thousand basically. Uh, so we now oh there's an Overaptor tournament. Ooh, I don't have Overaptor. Sweet, I've got I've got another chance to get it. Maybe this time I'm in with a chance. So we'll feed a ghost. Wait, what? What was that? Oh, it tells you the time and how long it takes to do it. Oh, that's cool. Well, we won't have to spend any more bucks because I have. Uh, oh yeah, we need to go to, we need to feed them all to level 10, yes, beautiful, and now James needs to remember to take away, oh, hold on, maybe we just, there you go, there's a print screen, close your eyes, <laughs> so James needs to edit out the print screen, but maybe he doesn't, because he's a lazy, <laughs> but anyway, we got, we only need, I think, is it eight fuses? I could be wrong. Maybe, maybe it's less. So at level 11. Oh, we've got the cloud of... <laughs> the cloud of stink. Sweet. Okay, our next fact is exceptionally savage, particularly cruel, and bred for extreme speed, Ghost is considered the perfect weapon. Which is interesting. Because out of all the Atrociraptors, Ghost, it, yes, it's the first one we see. But, I mean, that could be, you know, again, Colin going, hey, look, it's white like, a, you know, Dominus Rex. But at the same time, did it really do anything? It was like Tiger or something that chased Claire. I think Ghost did chase um, Owen Grady, but at the same time, I don't think it did much. <laughs> I think it just, like, fell. Uh, it didn't even, like, get a close call. It was- I don't even think it was the raptor that jumped onto the cargo plane and fell out. I think that was something else. So really, Ghost did a bugger all. Oh, here we go. We got another Code 19. And it's for something that we don't really need. So let's watch a level 11 or level 20 stinky boy eat, uh, nothing in the thing. Or at least we don't know. There's definitely something there. But uh, let's be honest, if we could, you know, take the camera off of its, like, anchor and look down, I think, we, I think we'd be able to find there's nothing in there. There was somebody who managed to um, hack the game or glitch the game in which, like, you could go ground level and you saw that there was no sky in the game. I thought that'd be really cool to actually, you know, move the camera, but I would, unfortunately it never got past that phase. So here we go, we got four fuses left. It's gonna cost me zero bucks. Oh, hold on, is this any good? We'll do this one, we'll do this one, because it's it's a decent amount of DNA. We oh, well, it, it started so well. <laughs> oh my God, there's a bloody helicopter outside. There we go, there we go, a 
Darwinopterus. And there it is. There's our first tent. Hopefully the audio is not glitching in my headphones. It is like cutting out every now and again. Hopefully for you guys, you, you're not noticing. I'll turn it very low down so you don't even notice. There you go. I'll help you. 30, 30, 30, 30. Okay, so what's next? There we go. And if we do one more? I mean, it did say it was 200, right? Um, we all... Oh, ho, 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 yes. 350. Could have been loads more if I hadn't have messed up the first one. But hey-ho. Uh, oh, we've, oh, we've also got missions as well. Yeah, so we need to check over this. Not only did Ludia very graciously and kindly generously, all the lovely words, um, give me Ghost Unlocked, but they also gave me the season pass for this thing. So we have got loads of packs to unlock and stuff like that. Uh, I've also got some more, oh yes, there you go. Oh, another one. Wait, what, how many? Ooh, we got loads. Bong, bong, bong. Yes, another level 11 Sukumimus instantly. That's really handy, actually. I like it, yeah. Also, some more of that stuff to collect. Maybe Molten Rex will, will unlock it eventually. I always forget. It's like, oh, claim, but it's not really. Claim one of those. Uh, where's Ghost? There's Ghost. Uh, now with extra stinky stink. Yes. I mean, I get why they've done it, because these are, like I said, since freaking 2015, I said, why don't we just get celebrity dinosaurs in here? That would be so good. And they've, they're kind of doing it now. It's taken them bloody long enough, like, <laughs> to get to it. Um, and then, you know, instead of changing the dinosaur, just, I mean, they could have given it, like, something a little bit more interesting than smoke. Or in this case, stink. Because <laughs> I think Bumpy has green, blue has blue, and a tr the ghost should have souls swarming around it. I mean, imagine. Ooh. But yeah, it, it, it pretty much doesn't look any different, but hey-ho. Yeah, yeah. And there we go, level 43, 610 health and 607 attack. Wonderful, yes. Ghost complete rude and looking gorgeous and stinky. Lovely. Right, let's have a look. What other facts do we get? We get some books, which are uh, ghost was created to track and hunt anyone marked with a red laser. Once marked, the target will be relentlessly chased by ghosts and her pack. Interesting. I thought it was just ghost, but okay. And fact four, give me even more books. Ghost gets her name from her white coloring. The stripes down her back and her vicious red eyes give her an extra menacing look. So unfortunately, we don't learn anything about ghost. Kinda of hoping we would. We did it, so yeah. <laughs> so this Oviraptor, as you can see, its background isn't Nublar or the Visitor Center. So I'm kind of hoping that if we do one battle with Ghost here, we will be in the Visitor Center and we'll be with the uh, the what do you call it? The um, shore, the shores, that the waterfall, the helipad looks really good. Uh, so. Wow, look at that! Even better than a level 10 Griffolith, a legendary hybrid! I mean, really, I could have put Ghost in first here, I feel. I'm just hoping that we get to see Ghost, you know, out and about, in the wild! If not, which we'll find out in a second. Oh, you this. Okay, actually, this is a pretty hard tournament. Oh, it's VIPs only! Even more reason to put it in a nicer arena. <laughs> but okay. That's interesting. Yeah, I, I do want to see Ghost, you know, out in the open. So we'll, we'll redo this battle with the PvP. Because when we do the PvP, I'll be able to see it in all of her glo in his glory. Her, I don't know. <laughs> I hate this arena. For years, it's, they've decided, you know what? We're not going to change it. We're just going to keep it. We could put in some code that randomizes the arena, I'm sure. But, uh, yeah, don't want to do that. We're going to have all of our dinosaurs. You know, you get to see them, or most of them, and most battles are here. And you're unfortunately only going to see them in the dark, which is great. Oh, I love it. Brilliant idea. Hold on. Because this is, you know, my old soundboard, I don't know what's in this. Oh, yeah. I can hear it cutting out. 
I saw that cut out there. There's a sound effect. Hold on, hold on. Let me just... Oh, maybe my headphones are. Oh, no, don't clear something. Ooh. Yeah! Wait, hold on. Is it cutting me out? Oh, God. Have I been cutting out this whole time? Oh, I don't know. I'm so sorry if I have been. No. Okay, I haven't been cutting out. It's great. <laughs> okay, for some odd reason, it's something to do with the mixer that is cutting out the in-game audio. Maybe. I don't know. We'll find out. If anyway, as you can hear it like, G -g 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 -g, it's cutting out. That's what I'm hearing. I don't know whether you are because I don't think you will be. I think it's my mixer. It's, it's doing something a bit dodgy. I don't know. Maybe we need to restart it. It's interesting. Uh, it could it could be the mixer. It could be because we're doing this the way it is. Uh, wow, we went up really high. This this has been out for like 24 hours, I assume. Right, okay. So we're going to have a look at um, the Atrociraptor in here. We'll obviously put uh, those guys in. I should have a free recovery because I don't really use these guys. Uh, if we go to Carnival. Where is it? Yes, there we go. Instant recovery. Sweet! Um, oh, I can just start like this? Ah, I didn't do the one that was the... What do you call it? Hopefully there's no uh, thingies. Good, there's not. Okay. I was going to say, if there's any Cenozoics, we won't be in here. But yes, look at it! Indominus and Ghost! Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, look at this! This looks amazing! I always... I get sentimental when I see a Dominus man, especially in this game. It's like, that's my beginnings! My beginnings! Oh my god, wow. Anyway, anyway. Hold on. La. I just want to see if we're cutting out. No, we're not. Okay, good. Right, so that was two attacks. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to go for one block, one reserve, because I don't want to die. Even though, actually, I could went for two reserves. It's still been okay. In fact, maybe what I'll do is I'll switch in Majungasaurus. I'm switching my jungle swords, then I'm definitely. Ooh. Okay, I think we should be good because that was everything it had, and actually I don't know if I can kill it. <laughs> we'll go for two reserves. That way, the Indominus Rex will have. To, it'll go for its three because it knows that three can kill me. I assume. I assume. We'll find out. Three. And I'm I'm just so big brain. I would do a sound effect. But yeah, anyway. Okay, yeah, you can hear it cut out. It's like... <laughs> uh, so yes, we can go for... Was three enough to kill it? It was enough! Right, okay, three attack! Slash! Rubbish takes down Indominus Rex. Now it is time for Majungasaurus. What is my headphones? Where my headphones are actually? I don't know. We'll fix it for the next recording thing I'll do. Don't you worry. <laughs> Beaver's got you. This is where we flash forward like a month and I still haven't fixed it. <laughs> uh, uh, right, okay. So, one, two, three. And then I guess I, I could actually wait for four, yeah. Anyway, there's another three. I just want to make sure that we do the seven to eight animation for the final kill. I was pretty sure that no matter what this thing did, we were good. What you gonna do at level level one? Oh my god! What are we gonna do? Right, okay. Seven attack, here we go. We can do 9,000, over 10,000 damage from that. Wee! Stinky! <laughs> that hurts too much. The stink is too strong. Gorgeous. Hopefully we get the rest of the air trust wrapped. It's going to be cool to do a battle with all of them. Although you can only do three, can't you? Uh, and of course, just like the game would always do, freaking amazing. Gives you coin. Coin. Love it. Anyway, okay, so that's that done. Uh, have we got anything else? Yes, so the Toro thing. Now, I have been doing this. For the past few ones, I haven't. I will admit, I've been like, Ugh, there's nothing new. I can't really be bothered. Um, but... That's an instant hatched uh, level 11 Sukumimus, which we can sell for 2,600, and we need it. Uh, that is nothing interesting, so we're going to ignore that. 
Uh, what else do we have? We have 180 books. Always good. 1,001. This is the thing. Moody have never given me resources in game. However, they have been fine to give me a free pass. So it's like, oh, well, we're not giving it for free, but you can earn it for free. <laughs> so I kind of want to save that pack for last. Um, so 137. Okay, I was wondering whether I would double because I'm a VIP, but I don't. So some extra food, some extra books. Uh, another Nordosaur fossil, because I did end up selling one of those, actually, I think. Um, uh, you know what it is? I'm not going to collect the food because I have that trade, don't I? So another 108 books. Wow, we're, get, we're getting so much here. This is great. Really, I, I do want the DNA. The DNA and the books are the main things because I have spent a lot. Another Sukavimus! So that is another. I mean, we could fuse it, I suppose. Like, feed them, fuse it, and then sell it for more. I think. I assume, like, a level 30 sells for more than two level 20s. But I don't know about the math on that, actually. Hmm. I could have done that, actually. Uh, well, anyway. Uh, for another time, I assume. Uh, we've still got... Oh, no, that's it. Okay. And I'm not spending 500 to get an extra. Uh, no point really getting the coins. But we will do the Carnivore Raw Pack. So we have a chance of getting Toro in this. And we do, of course we do. And of course we all get food. Sweet. But there it is, the 260 VIP points, which, you know, we slowly get a uh, carnival roll pack. I don't think there's any chance of getting Toro in that, however. So we will unlock Toro, and we will, we should get two Toros by the end of this season pass, because we get one for the pack, and we unlock one, so you just get one for free. Macro Super DNA! Oh my god, that is dead! Woo! That is good! That is another carnival roll, I'll take it! I'll take the extra food. Gorgeous. Only 100 VIP points. Could be better. Another roll pack. Would be nice for some DNA. Extra hundo. Uh, and a max. Um, ooh, a thousand DNA. Yes. I think we're 1,200. Oh, sorry. 125,000 DNA or something like that, wouldn't we? Uh, and that is it. So if we scroll to the. I think it's 75, yeah, 7,250. So you do get the Toro pack. You do get some good prizes. You do unlock it. And if you don't, however, have the season pass, you do get Toro anyway. Uh, you do basically get a level 30 Sukumimus for free. Uh, well, you know, if you paid for the pass as well as getting like this one, you got a 6% chance of getting Toro, and then a 3% chance for a Spinosaurus Gen 2, which isn't too bad, really. The Toro is a pretty decent chance. You've got a similar chance of getting a Sukumimus or a Spinosaur, basically. Uh, but of course, you've got the 20% chance for Irritator and Giga. So, a little bit more chance of that, if you're gonna be honest. Uh, but that is going to have to wrap up this. Just collect a few more of these. I think we've got like some sort of Instagram thing to get likes to get us more of that. I will uh, pop in a... Ooh, we could speed up that for free. Heck yeah! Uh, we'll sell it. Yes, can I do another one? I think that's part of my mission, so we as well just do a couple of missions while I'm here. Sell that, yes. Uh, but leave down in the comments below, did you manage to unlock Ghost through regular means? I didn't, because <laughs> I'm stupid. But thankfully, I did manage to get that, so maybe we'll get hybrids in the future. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye-bye.